Hey guys, today we are making office supplies out of gum paste. I am going to be making a post-it, a paper clip, and a push pin. And you guys are not gonna believe which one was the hardest to make. I am going to start with the post-it. White gum paste, a little bit of yellow fondant mixed up together, and then flatten it and make it super, super thin, like a paper. Then I'm using a real post-it to cut the right size. This is the hardest part, getting creative and making sure that I give this paper a little bit of movement. So I use the tubs of fondant and that's gonna hold them until they dry. I will make a few of these. And the one little thing about the post is it's that they seem to always have one corner a little bent. So notice I will do that in all of the ones I make. Again, getting creative with other things to hold the paper, little post-it in place until it dries, which, cause it's so thin, it won't take very long. Another one, there's the little tip I'm talking about, and this is the most fun and hardest one, a wrinkled one. The thing about wrinkled paper is that it has very sharp angles. So you gotta make sure and you try to replicate some of those sharp angles in the wrinkled gum paste post-it. to the next one. This is the tip I use for my clay extruder and that's gonna make a whole lot of very thin strands of gum paste. They're so thin it's hard to get out. But basically that's all we need for this one. Now this was actually the hardest part of all of these shaping these little paper clips was surprisingly complicated. Uh, for some reason, I kept shaping them and they just did not look right. You see the corners are kind of a little bit too pointy. So it actually took me a lot of time to get those corners to look realistic. What I'm showing you right now, I have already made several of these before, so this is not the first or second try. So you can imagine the first and second try was a lot harder. But that's it. Once you get the shape right, then you're done. Okay, now I'm going to make a push pin and I will roll out a nice thick piece of yellow fondant and with a 12 tip piping point, I'm going to cut a very nice thick circle. Then I rolled it out thin and I caught another circle. Now I am going to put a little bit of dab and hold on a half a toothpick and I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of yellow gum paste onto the toothpick, shape it around it. I actually squeeze the thick circle that I cut out earlier. I squeezed it down with my finger and I made it nice and round on the top. And now I am squeezing it through the bottom part. That's going to be the bottom of the push pin. And now I am going to attach the smaller circle on the very top of my push pin. And that's it. I actually went ahead and I colored the toothpick with some silver food color. All of the office supplies finished and now this are the office supplies on a cake.
All right, guys, that's it. The tastiest office supplies you have ever seen. I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video. Don't forget, subscribe to my channel, hit that thumbs up and that bell icon if you want to get notified next time a video comes out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys again next week. Bye.